we are once again another beautiful day in the woods it poured last night everything here is soaking wet and that always poses a new challenge trying to get firewood everything's damp tinders damp woods damp etc but we're out here i'm going to keep on keeping on i'm going to get it done for you all heading out to a base camp or what me and medium-sized dude are calling a base camp and we're going to do some type of build watching tv last night went to the old archives and i found rambo and it got me thinking hmm dude's held up in a cave or a mining shaft kills a pig prior to that drags it in there makes a fire leans up against some rocks sticks to breathe and cooks a chunk of meat so i'm thinking solo overnight in a rambo camp let's get to it Okay, so here we are. We made it to base camp, or what me and medium-sized dude are referring to as our base camp. This big, large, open area out here. Got the woods in front of us, behind us. All sides of us were surrounded. And yes, that's materials over there from a previous build. Some people are triggered right now. They're gonna be like, Corporal's Corner is staged. Well, meaning staged that I collected all the rocks and little dude or medium-sized dude collected all the branches. Um, then yeah, it's staged. But other than that, here we are. So here's what I'm thinking. Utilizing that tree right there and that natural curved branch that comes off of it and continues all the way down I'm thinking build those bad boys up. Give me two walls Add another wall here large reflector out there. Maybe a reflector of rocks and clay. Who knows? We'll see how much time we have left But that will give me coverage on three sides Fire in the front Maybe a tarp on top something simple utilizing the resources of the landscape and Just add a chunk of meat and we're killing it, Rambo style. Let's go ahead and pause for a minute. All the gear in my videos can be found in two places. One, my Amazon influencer page, and two, my Self-Reliance Outfitters influencer page. Both links can be found inside my description box or simply go to corporalaf.com. I'm over here killing it, and where's Cole Cracker? At home drinking beers, <laughs> shaking my damn head.
And that right there, boys and girls, is not only an excuse to use a hatchet, it also qualifies your video to have the word bushcraft in the title. So now sitting here looking at this, these things are heavy AF by the way. And once again, in the modern era, I'm probably the hardest working man in show business, on YouTube anyway. I'm thinking, let's put these over there for a back wall for an optional tarp. And then utilize that in the front combined with these rocks for a windscreen for a fire, for a long fire. No rain in the forecast tonight, but you never know. Um, but I'm thinking, you know, Rambo camp under the stars right here. Boom, windscreen, long fire. My fat butt, backstop.
So I'm sitting here doing a lot of thinking and reflecting on my life, and I just realized that I did whatever it took to get away from the construction business in order to be a full-time YouTuber. Yet here I am doing construction. That's not karma, what is? Not bad for a couple hours with the work, tell you what. But here's what I'm thinking. Those that follow my channel all the time, religiously, you know what I'm thinking. See other gaps right here in the wood? The gaps in the rocks over here? I'm not happy with that. And I know one way guaranteed to plug those holes. And it's going to suck. So walking through here, it didn't even dawn on me that the ground's wet. It rained all day yesterday and last night. And last week when we came out here, it was a dry creek bed. So just goes to show that one good 24 hour rain can actually start filling this back up. Now I know there's a pond over here that drains into this. So that bad boy's probably getting filled up as well. So good thing that we're here now and not later. Let's go ahead and grab that clay and then make like a tree and get out of here. Now for the real sucky part, up the hill. Tell you what, that's easily 100 pounds and that's about a thousand yard walk. Check this out. The bag was actually ripping apart too. Imagine that, you get up here and be like, oh look, and there's nothing left in it and then head back down. Hell no. This is stuff that nightmares are made out of. I'll tell you what. We're gonna knead it a little bit, get it flexible, kind of like Play-Doh. And then simply pack it in. Which reminds me of a song. Wanna hear it? Here it goes. Pack it up, pack it in, let me begin.
I came here to win. Battle me. That's a sin. Just saying. So far so good, we're looking outstanding. I'm happy with that for a solo overnighter. Um, it's actually a lot of work right there. A lot got accomplished for one day. Um, so I'm thinking, walk through here, collect some firewood, and then get that fire going, and it's chow time. Let's go ahead and pause one more time. If you like what you see here, please do me that favor. Hit that like and subscribe button, then ring that notification bell. Once you ring that bell, please select all notifications. And then please take it a step further. Get on your iPhones and download the free YouTube app and sign in. This will give you push notifications as soon as a new video drops. We're talking about Rambo being held up in that mine shaft, killing that pig and cutting a piece of meat off and then eating it. Well, bacon wrapped pork tenderloin. Eat your heart out, Rambo, John Jay. Oh my god. Meat. Mmm. Perfection. Now I'm sitting here. And just dawned on me. I'm looking at this shelter. We got basically a log cabin style wall behind me. 
reflector over here and rocks. And I'm thinking, build with rocks, clay, and logs. I can make a makeshift shanty or a tiny log cabin right here. That'd give me a good three, four, five, six episodes. Fireplace over here, like a miniature rocket stove. Walls about four foot high, that way I can sit up in there. Two people could be in here, me a medium sized dude. Fireplace, could be 10 degrees outside and be in here sweating. Yeah, let me know what you think about that. Drop me a comment in the comment section if you're interested in that and I can make that happen. That'd be a good project. Until then, bacon wrapped meat. Oh. Lights fading fast. Let's be quick and to the point. Quick and to the point. Now, someone's gonna say, he's complaining about YouTube, I'm out of here. Well, then you're out of here. I'm keeping you informed as to what's going on with my channel. So when you wake up one day and say, where did he go? How come he didn't post? Where's his channel? What happened? You know why. Now, over the past few weeks, past few months, my channel views have done this. If you don't believe me, go back and look. You're gonna see this, okay? And to keep my channel from becoming a dead channel, I rely on you all. I'm supplying the content, and I request that you watch the videos, watch them all the way through, share them with everybody, everywhere. Now with that said, let's conduct an experiment. After you watch this video, or any of my videos, you'll see videos pop up in the recommendation list. The next one, most of the time, is not mine. I'm probably 10 or 30th down of my own videos. Do me a favor, seek out those videos and let them play. Run them all the way through. Go do housework, go do yard work, go do your job. Let it play through. I wanna see if that will actually activate or trick the algorithm into picking up my channel saying, hmm, these people wanna watch more of Corporal's Corner. Let's give the people what they want. We're doing this for you, the people. Doesn't work, no harm, no foul, but at least we tried. Told you, getting dark fast. All right, and last but not least, my thank you. Thank you to all my new subs for checking me out, sticking around, you're in for a hell of a ride. And for my old subs, thank you for sticking around for all these years. You're still in for a hell of a ride. With that said, I appreciate everybody. My channel would not be where it's at today without you all. I only supply the content, you guys watch the content. With that, please, as a reminder, share my videos with everyone, everywhere. Let's make a difference and let's stick around for another 12 years. Thank you. Always survive the night. Zero early AF. I mean, I don't want to get up. But with this wall back here being solid like this with the clay, dude, that heat was going around me all night. With a small fire, I was good to go. Um, so I know for a fact, once we build this damn thing, it's going to be rock solid, and warm and toasty all night. So I need to get up. It's coffee time. But I got something different today. Let's go ahead and try it out.
Black Rifle Combat Cocoa. Ah, Nectar of the Gods. Tell you what, outstanding. Let's go ahead and talk about that shelter. What do we do here exactly? Well, as usual, one video blends into the next. We went down and harvested clay. We had rocks and sticks on hand. <clears throat> we had dead debris, meaning dead logs and trees everywhere. And we created basically a trapper's cabin. We took it a step further. Went in and filled all the gaps in with clay and had a makeshift windscreen over there. And for the most part, comfy and cozy all night. Now, as you can tell, it's really windy today. It was windy last night as well. And the wind's not gonna stop. Season's changing. So, like we talked about last night, or we touched on, looking at this in the daylight, I really believe that we can turn this thing into an actual cabin. And it also give me a series of videos, constructing a cabin or a fort in the woods. So, I'm gonna go for it. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Welcome back. Last night's shelter build was outstanding. And, like I mentioned before, could lead to something bigger and better. Hopefully lead to something bigger and better. As always, all the gear in my video can be found in two places. One, my Amazon influencer page, and two, my Self-Reliance Outfitters influencer page. Both links can be found in my description box, or simply go to corporalaf.com. Now, please do me that favor. Hit that like and subscribe button. Then ring that notification bell. Once you ring that bell, please select all notifications. Then take it a step further. Grab your iPhone and download the free YouTube app and sign in. This will give you push notifications when my new video drops. As always, thank you for your comments, views, and support. Thanks for watching. Get out in the field, have some fun. I'm going to catch you next time.